Yes, hello, Andy here with a very quick juice review. Um, I'm doing it like this against the green screen, just uh, no editing as live um, because basically I edit all day and um, I'm doing this review without an edit in it. So uh, it's literally do the review, put it up there, right? And tonight I've got a juice review for you. I bought this juice because it's been talked about on the forums quite a bit. Um, I've seen a couple of video reviews as well of it. Uh, let me show you what it is. It's um, a very interesting juice. There it is. And um, it's from just here. House of Liquid. El Toro, 18 milligrams. And you get 50 mil for £18.80. Now, this juice has had loads of people talking about it. It's been, from what I can see, flying off the shelves. And uh, I was keen to try some. So I ordered some. And um, it came in this nice glass bottle. Um, it's got a label on there. Uh, a split label as well, so you can see how much juice is in there. Now, it didn't come it didn't come with this dropper cap. I've put that on there. It just came with the, the little uh, the dribbly cap that... Um, the child safety cap so it, it comes child safe which is good and um, well I suppose I should talk about what it tastes like really and I've got it loaded up on um, a low resistance Bogue 510 cartomizer on my lava tube and I am running it at 3.6 now I know what you're saying I can hear you it's 18 milligrams well, that's as strong as you can get at the moment. That's what I believe. I, that's all I could order from uh, House of Liquid. So uh, I got 18 milligrams because, you know, I do occasionally vape 18 milligrams. Not all the time. Mostly 24 and 36. But um, if I like a flavour, I will, I will I will do an 18. That sounds wrong. Anyway, um, so yes, El Toro. Let's talk about it. There it is in this bottle. And uh, let me give you a vapor. Let me tell you what it tastes like at 18 milligrams. Oh, now the reviews I have seen, they have said that it's very analogy, meaning that it tastes like a conventional tobacco burning cigarette. Now, I know what they're saying. It reminds me of another e-liquid and um, I, won't, I won't say which one it reminds me of um, but it is very tobacco-y it's an incredibly sweet tobacco-y nutty oaky moorish lovely tobacco flavour so the throat hit now At 18, milligram <coughs> 18 milligrams, it really does pack a punch, actually. Um, on the exhale, you get the sweetness. It's not overly sweet, but it's it's very... It's just slight caramel notes um, in amongst a sort of uh, peanutty, hazelnut, um, oaky flavour. You know, like, like a... Um, a whiskey that's been aged in oak it tastes a bit like that and it is very very moorish I'm glad I got 50 mil now 18 pounds 80 seems quite a lot of money but it's 50 mil and it's really good juice and it tastes great it's great with beer it's a good after dinner vape because it I know what people are saying now it's got that sort of to, like when you open a packet of analog tobacco cigarettes, it it tastes like the smell of a new pack. Um, without there's no ash taste, there's no you know um, no bull. No, there is a bull actually. There is a bull on the bottle, um, but there's um, no there's no there's no ash taste. There's no um, 
There's the, 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 all, all the bad bits from an analogue are absent, which is great. Which is great. So, yeah. Um, I have, at the moment, let me just show you. Uh, you can't see that. Um, uh, uh, three point, uh, I'll go up to four volts. This is a low resistance um, cast miser. Really, really good vapor production. I don't think it says. It says, um... ah, there we go. Okay, interesting. I've just noticed here it's 50% uh, propylene glycol and 50% vegetable glycerin. Now it says on the bottle here pharma grade nicotine, uh, pharmaceutical, and natural. Uh, there was some talk on the, um, the forums of. Uh, naturally extracted nicotine from tobacco and I believe that's where it gets its unique tobacco like flavor because it's actually tobacco e it's been it's had tobacco infusing um, but that doesn't matter it's all about the flavor and the throat hit for me it's good stuff I would buy it and I have and I'm glad I did so um, Yes. What else can I say? I'm sort of out of uh, out of practice about doing these reviews. I apologise, but I hope you like the new setup. I've actually got a bigger green screen, which means I can oh, you know, I can I can move around a little bit more, a little bit, you know. So anyway, you don't care about that. You just want to know about the juice. The juice came from uh, HouseOfLiquid.com, based in the UK. And uh, that was El Toro at 18 milligrams. And it is good stuff. It is. It tastes like the smell of a packet of cigarettes. Fifty fifty PG VG mix is giving me good, good vapor production. It's putting my green screen all. It's messing it up. It's good stuff. Anyway, yeah, so there we go. Ah, <sighs> lovely. I'm going to go and have a cup of coffee and enjoy this lovely El Toro tobacco flavoured e liquid. So, yes, if you like nutty, slightly sweet tobacco flavoured e liquids, I would give El Toro a go. So, I've been Smoke to Vape, you've been fantastic. As ever, thanks for watching.